That's okay, Batman. Don't worry. Thanks, officer. Welcome! So I'm back with another Funko Pop unboxing and yes you've guessed it once again this is a purchase from eBay. I've made a lot of purchases from eBay. There is still more to come, I'm still waiting on some more in the post. For me eBay is a great place to find second hand, pre-owned as people like to say Funko Pops. Um, yes it's a gamble depending on how the buyer packages and the level of customer service etc but uh, generally 99 times out of 100 i've been absolutely delighted with ebay no matter what that i've been buying and i've also done selling on ebay on and off for many years as well this is a funko pop that is part of a collection that i've been building up hopefully you will have seen the intro so you will have a fairly good idea which one this may be i think including postage this was £19 all in. It was one of those that was in an auction, but you're able to make a best offer. I think the auction was starting at like £18 or £19, and then it was going to end in a couple of days or so. I thought, you know what, let's see if I can get this early. So I made an offer. I think they counted with whatever it would have been, something like 16 and then £3 postage. Taking it to 19 altogether, I accepted that, and hence I hold it in my hand today. So... All that needs to be done now, excuse me, <laughs> nothing like Dale's was it, is to get my trusty yellow knife ready, steady and into action. Free as a bird, it's the next best thing to be. Free as a bird, low, home and dry, and your morning bird will fly, and your bird has wings. All right, and now let us have a... This all woo. So let me crack into this. I unboxed a pop in this line a couple of days or so ago. That was quite expensive. This one, not as expensive, but older. Certainly been vaulted for a long time. I'm hoping it's come in good condition about £16 or £15.90 or whatever it was, I can't remember the exact price for this. It's a little bit high, but this was the best price that I saw for this particular character. Impressed with the packaging, that's for sure. Plenty of bubble wrap in here. Oh, and some shredded paper at the bottom. Fortunately, when I chucked that down, I didn't make a mess. Speaking of making a mess on the floor, shout out to Not Suitable for Mum. Don't forget to put some newspaper down again, Jace. Oh, yes. Oh, marvellous. Love it. So, the Funko Pop in question is number 42 in the Pop Heroes line. It is in the classic Batman TV series. It's the Boy Wonder, of course. Robin, a.k.a. Dick Grayson, played in the show by Burt Ward. Baby on board something something Bert Ward absolutely fantastic so I've got Robin another hero to add to uh, my collection I think the only hero that I've unboxed so far has been Batgirl we'll have a quick look at the back but uh, not an awful lot to see here as it's a relatively small line I don't have Batman yet obviously I've just unboxed Robin there's Catwoman and there is the Joker all fantastic pops no doubt this one i think was from like 2013 2014 and the box is in pretty good condition yeah for its age i've got no complaints um festooned with a couple of stickers on the bottom 
the old Funko logo. Kind of creased look, but on the bottom that doesn't matter. A couple of creases on the sides and on the top, but as with pretty much all my pops that I keep in box, once they're in a pop protector, they look fine. You know, that's the other good thing about pop protectors. Not only do they do what they say they do on the tin, as it were, they protect your pops, but they also just make them look more premium. They've got that sort of sheen to them. So uh, it makes your collection look better as well, I think, as well as actually serving a purpose for protecting your Funkos. But yeah, absolutely made up to have got a Robin in my collection. I've never had a Robin pop before. Let's get him out temporarily. Oh, he's ace. I love him. So he's got a very slight blemish on his eye there. Quite unique for a pop to have white eyes, but with his eye mask being black, it makes sense. So yeah, very slight blemish there. I don't know if that's sort of some of the white paint having come off or uh, a bit of black paint where it shouldn't be, but it doesn't matter. I mean, from a distance, you can't even tell. He's got short brown hair. As I say, black eye mask, yellow cape. Red and green sort of bodysuit type thing. He's got his R symbol there on his left pectoral. Black belt, green knickers and green boots. On oh, green gloves, of course. A colourful guy. Um, the Boy Wonder, the Cape Crusaders, Faithful Companion and Bruce Wayne's Ward. Which I think is kind of like you've sort of adopted someone, I'm not entirely sure. Robin, another one in the classic Batman collection. I've really got to watch that show again. I'm going to have to treat myself to the Blu-rays soon. Because the more I unbox these Funko Pops, the more I just realise I want to see all these classic episodes again. As it has literally been like 30 years or more since I've seen most of them. And there we have him back in his box. Robin. The 1960s Robin, no doubt absolutely marvellous as you all know by now i'm having a hell of a lot of fun putting together this classic 1960s batman series not many more to go now um hopefully i will have at least a couple more to show you in the very near future so stay tuned to this channel of course thank you all for watching as always a massive thank you to my subscribers and my patrons Please enter the Funko Family International One Week Funko Pop Giveaway if you haven't already. Or if you don't want to enter, then please click the link at the top of the description and share that video out with everyone on social media. There's only a few days left to go before I make the draw. So thank you to all those who have entered so far. Good luck to you all and anyone else. You've still got time to enter while ever I'm talking about it in videos, obviously. Also in my video description, further on down, will be all my usual Funko affiliate links. I'm going to go now and put Dick Grayson, aka Robin, into an All Things Vinyl Pop Protector. My preferred Pop Protector, don't forget. I highly recommend them always. And put him with the rest of his Batman castmates. And I do hope that all of you will join me again next time for my next Funko Pop unboxing. Cheers, everyone. See ya!